fam, it's your girl Gladys. Welcome back to the channel. I create hair, fashion, and lifestyle content that'll encourage you to be your very best self. So if you're with that, you're in the right place. Welcome to my doll Tuesday. This is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute hair and fashion finds for the lovely $20 price range and below. Thank you to all of you who have been sticking with me as I have not been as consistent with $20 Tuesday. And... I'm just really trying to push through because there's a lot going on right now, personally, and especially pertaining to the holidays. But you know, I'm still here. You can also still find me on other platforms. I've been very active on TikTok and Instagram. Is that your hair? So please check me out on those platforms when you don't see me on YouTube. But at the end of the day, YouTube is my baby. Y'all are like my favorites. <laughs> So I always come back and I definitely had to come back with today's wig. But before I get into the wig for today, do y'all see this hair in my head? <laughs> Is this my hair or not? I have been obsessed with this. I did showcase this for the last $20 Tuesday a few weeks ago and y'all were loving it. And as you can see, the older it gets, the better it looks. Like it looks even more more natural straight out the pack it's definitely more defined as far as the curls but i've been raking my fingers through this and just with everyday wear this is what it comes out like and i'm just so obsessed with it i've been trimming at the ends a little bit too as it's gotten older it's a little bit stiff right here in the back but again y'all this is synthetic hair it's not human it's nothing that my silicone spray can't handle at the end of the day so if you want an update on this wig by outre her name is curl strip by the way this is your update. It's been treating me very nicely. I love it. And I definitely would purchase this one again. If you want to check this out, you can find the link in my description box as well as everything I talk about in this video, you can always find in the description box. Also, I just wanted to quickly touch on this month of December. Normally I do Is That Your Hair holiday. And I still want to do Is That Your Hair holiday, but it's going to be a very mixed bag. So you will see some hair content, but you will also see vlogs because I have so much vlog content that I've been keeping just in the back. Like... <laughs> And I'm tired of keeping it stored. I want to get it out to y'all because one of my goals this year was to create more vlogs so y'all can kind of see a little bit more of my life. If you're here for the vlogs, drop me some comments. Let me know. They are coming and you will see them throughout the month of December. I will say though, this will be the last Is That Your Hair holiday because your girl has been wanting to change her name for a while. Some of you may not agree with that, but I, I just know how I feel in regards to is that your hair the brands I just I just want a little switch up I've been wanting it for a while so at some point in 2023 it won't happen right away but I do see myself changing my name I just haven't found the right name yet so when it happens you all will know just be on the lookout for that next year so this is the last is that your hair holiday and I really hope that y'all enjoy it especially because this is my birthday month December 22nd is my birthday I do plan on dropping a vlog on my birthday too hopefully that goes the way it's supposed to this this month is gonna be a lot I'm really trying to get out some good content for y'all so those of you that have been finding me on other platforms and keeping up with me on my YouTube community tab thank you so much for that and just for being patient with me all right y'all let's get into this hair this is Brindley a new outre wig from the wig pop collection and wig pop is their super affordable collection that doesn't require you to fumble with any lace you don't really have to use any glue it's something you're just supposed to be able to pop on your head and go and this is Brindley I haven't even cut this thing off hold on now I know some of y'all saw me rocking a wig during the summer into the fall season which is a free trust equal wig called Brisa I haven't found anything that compares to Brisa Brisa is like bae but unfortunately she's discontinued so I'm wondering if Miss Brindley could end up being a contender of some sorts. I wanted to get the natural color. Why didn't I do that? I don't remember why. I think they didn't have any more too, so I just ended up getting this copper color. Ginger copper balayage. Balayage? <laughs> Something like that. I mean, the color is popping, and you can see that it's nicely rooted at the top with the 1B. Now, this has like a typical closure that bang wigs have, synthetic bang wigs. I normally don't like when it looks like that, so I like to pluck hairs out, and then also I like to add some powder just to give it like a more scalp-like appearance. I also think I'm gonna like the bangs in this unit. I like more of a fringe 
um, lighter bang and this is giving me it's giving me that so I just hope that with the way that this is constructed it looks good on me this is what the inside of the cap looks like you got your comb right here two combs to the side a comb in the back and it's a wig pop wig so I'm about to take my little fluffy afro baddie off and you can see like how easy it is y'all literally I just pull off this rubber band and pull off this wig honey <laughs> oh my god let me tell you my hair underneath is basura it does not look good under here I'm embarrassed y'all don't want to see I need to get my hair done this week I don't braid my hair myself I go to the salon but it's been like two months since I've been I'm really pushing it oh my god anyway we're just gonna pop Brindley on and see if she's hitting for anything I'm gonna put these adjustable straps in put this on okay it feels comfortable hold on Hold on, wait a minute. Can we, can we get something popping with Miss Brinley? Where's my comb? Hold on a second. Wait, wait a second, y'all. Hold on. Wait a second. Oh, this cap is fitting snug. If you have a bigger head, you probably do not even want to put the adjustable straps because this is fitting tight and I have a medium sized head. But hold on, wait a sec. Hold on a second. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Give me a second because, oh, wow. Okay, so off the break, this texture, the fact that this is a textured bang wig is giving me life. Okay, let's talk about the most important part, the bangs. I actually like the way the bangs look on me. I'm very particular about bangs. Oh, wait a minute. I like the way this is framing my face. You guys. You guys. Okay, this is what the crown's looking like. You guys, I haven't done anything to this wig. So normally with synthetic bang wigs, I feel like I have to do the most. I always feel like the crown is humpy and I always have to apply heat to press it down. I don't even feel like it looks bad without doing anything and low-key this is a type of wig where i would probably just straighten it out like kind of like how i did my brisa i might not keep the bun ends look at how it's framing my face here this is pretty all right y'all so i went downstairs just now while i was downstairs i actually plucked some hairs out of the crown area this is how much hair that I plucked out of there. Uh, I would say this is a pretty good amount. And the reason why I do that is because, again, with these type of bang wigs where it's, you know, circular at the crown, it just looks humpy. And so I realized over time that taking hairs out of the crown will help it lay a little bit flatter. Now, mind you, my hair underneath is not at its flattest, but I think this is actually still looking pretty good considering how my hair is underneath. And look, if you get up close here, you know, you can see there's like a little opening here at the crown and normally that is where I would put the powder but I have one more step I'm going to flatten the crown with heat okay I'm just taking my blow dryer using the blow dryer is another step that I like to take to kind of help flatten everything down and y'all I I was not expecting this. For this to be a bang wig with no lace closure, this is actually laying very nicely. I think Outre did a great job at the construction of this wig because I, I like the layers. I love the bang area. It's a nice fringe bang. It's actually exactly how I like my bangs. I don't like my bangs like super thick and straight across. I like them to be like a little bit wispy. These bangs are perfect for me. This color is popping. Oh my God, do y'all see this color on my skin? It's got the, the true copper in the front and then this dark reddish color underneath. Great length and the layers are nice. I think we have a winner for $17? Kudos to you, Utre, because I'm I'm here for it. I'm definitely, I think this looks very, very cute. Like, I want to get this in a 1B color. 
Oh my god. <laughs> a bitch is cute. <laughs> However, I do have one gripe, y'all. In the year of our Lord and Savior, in the year of 2022, why is it that we are still coming out with these bang wigs that don't have a lace closure? That is why a lot of us love Free Trust Brisha because it was the first one of its kind with a lace closure on a synthetic wig. And when I say lace closure, I mean it looks like this. You see this video? This is a clip from my old video. Like This Brisa wig was one of my first YouTube videos on the platform. That's what I'm talking about by lace closure. Most bang wigs do not have this. Why can't we make this? We have the technology. And at this point, I am fine with paying the extra $10 y'all wanna charge to do it. Ultra, if you end up watching this video, someone sends you this clip, please listen. Can you please make Brindley as gorgeous as she is? I just need her to have some lace at the closure part. Like, can we please make that happen? And y'all will see the difference. Like, it lays even flatter when you have the lace here versus the closure. I wouldn't feel the need necessarily to do the extra heat. I wouldn't feel the need to pluck hair out of the crown. Oh my God. That's my only thing. Like, can we please do that? I will pay $27. I'll pay $30 for a wig like that. A synthetic wig like that with this texture? Absolutely. Oh, real quick, one more thing. Applying powder. I just take my Maybelline Press powder here and I go here and I just apply it like right in the center there. Y'all see that? That's what I do when I kind of wanted to emulate a part. So yes, y'all, this is Brindley. I think overall, given the price point, she's definitely a winner. Let me know what your thoughts are. Is she a good contender for the infamous Free Trust Equal Brisa? Let me know. What I can tell right now, I am definitely feeling her and I'm ready to wear her out. <laughs> I have nowhere to go, but I'm about to make some plans because I think she is so freaking cute. This is definitely the best bang wig I have tried in a long time since Brisa. I can confidently say that. Again, if you have a bigger head, she might be a little tight on you, but I think it's worth the buy. I think it's worth the try and absolutely worth this color. You can't get color like this for under $20, y'all. You just can't. That is why I love synthetic wigs. I can try different colors without having to go through coloring a wig myself. That can take so long sometimes on human hair, but I can just pop this on oh my god this looks so good i would love to wear this type of copper hair with like a nice denim dress let me let me get off this screen and go make some plans because this this is too much i hope y'all enjoyed the video make sure you tune in for more videos from is that your hair holiday and remember we're mixing up the content we're doing more vlogs this month i hope you enjoy it please catch me on tiktok on instagram all that jazz and if you're new to my youtube channel i would love if you subscribe and join the family you can also check out some of my latest videos over here to the right of me thank y'all so much for joining me for 20 dollars tuesday i love y'all so so much y'all don't even know and i'll see you in the next one Bye.